I had to stay there, sleep there. It stunk, and you know, there were ants crawling around. Did you sleep about an hour, two hours a night? Um, you were in such a mental state that you're very controllable, very suggestible. He must have been one of the unhappy customers, or as John Travolta put it, people who were disgruntled with their experiences. Travolta finally broke his silence regarding the HBO Scientology documentary Going Clear during a phone interview with the Tampa Bay Times. Even though the Saturday Night Fever star hasn't even watched the documentary, he had a lot to say about not having a lot to say. I've been so happy with my Scientology experience in the last 40 years that I really don't have anything to say that would shed light on a documentary so decidedly negative. Scientology has been under intense scrutiny for years, but Travolta maintains the positive benefits of membership, saying, I've helped so many people through hard times, loss of children, loved ones, physical illnesses. Through many tough, tough life situations, I've used the technology to support them and help them. It's always worked. Ooh, I love technology. I wonder if there's an app for that. While more and more people continue to watch the documentary, John Travolta will not be one of them. The star said, so why would I even approach a negative perspective? That would be a crime to me personally to do that. Good for John for taking the high road. He is so good at avoiding uncomfortable situations. I'm Nikki Boyer. Make sure to check out our daily TV recap show, What You Missed, right here on this site. Could you connect me to the Tampa Bay Times, please? Hold please. Do, 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 Tampa Bay Times. So you're ready for John Travolta? Hold please. So you're connected. <laughs> <laughs>